Okay, we have here today another integral. This one's from the MIT Integration B 2019, problem number one. We have the integral from zero to two pi, tan of cosine x dx. Okay, I know quite a few different ways to do this one, and I guess the quickest way is probably gonna be just looking at a graph. From a graph, you're gonna be able to see the answer just visually. What I wanna do is just gonna be a couple seconds slower because we need to do this check. I wanna do this check for f of x plus pi on this. We'll be calling the whole integral here. This will all be our f of x. And if we can get this check to work where this is gonna be minus f of x, then the whole integral is gonna be zero. And for this one, it's really useful to know a couple of trig identities. So for cosine x plus pi, this is just gonna be the same thing as minus cosine x. So doing our check for f of x plus pi, we have just tan of cosine x plus pi. No, not pi plus pi, that doesn't make any sense. <laughs> x plus pi over here, okay. And then if this is gonna be minus cosine x, what we can do is tangent is an odd function, which is gonna allow me to take the minus sign and bring it up front here. So we have minus tan cosine x, but that's just gonna be the same thing as minus f of x. And so this check is true, and so our whole integral is just zero. And now if you want to see how this works, what we can do is we can just kind of do this out the long way because it's still not going to be very long to just break it up and show how this goes. So what we want to do is we want to break this up on pi, just breaking the upper bound in half. So if we do this, so we have one integral going from zero to pi of tan cosine x. Then our second integral is just going to be going from pi to two pi. And then what we're going to do is we'll do a u substitution on the second one. We'll just focus on this one. And for the substitution, all I want to do is adjust the bounds so that it looks like this. So for that, what we just need to do is take x and subtract pi from it. We can also, we can solve for our value for x. So x is going to be u plus pi. Take a derivative. We have dx is going to be equal to du. So then we'll just update this integral right here and bring it down. What's gonna happen on this is this is gonna become, now we're going from zero to pi on this. We get, if we just substitute in our x value right here, this is gonna become tan cosine u plus pi. But this right here is really the same thing we just did like two seconds ago, because we know this right here is gonna become cosine, sorry, minus cosine of u, and because it's an odd function, we can bring it out front. So what we'll do is we'll take the minus sign all the way up front of the integral, rewriting this in terms of u, this is gonna become tan cosine u du. But then let's change our variable back to x because the definite integral, I can change the variable, so we'll make this cosine x dx, bring this one down. But now this integral here is exactly the same as this integral here. We subtract them and we get back to our solution of just zero. Okay, there you go. Really quick one from MIT 2019. Thanks everyone for watching. Have a good day.